Hello friends, today I'll be running through how to have Legacy, Evrima and the Test Branch all on the same PC without having to re-download every time you switch. But before I get into it, if you find this video helpful, informative or you just want to help me out, just hit that like button and subscribe if you want to see more videos just like this in the future. If you still need help after this, comment down below the things that you need help with. To start, you must have Legacy or another branch downloaded. For simplicity's sake, I have deleted all of mine so I can start from scratch with you for this video. If you don't have the aisle, just download Legacy um, to start. Once you're ready, we'll start. Firstly, you want to go to Browse Local Files. Now, once you click it, it'll go into the aisle files, but you actually don't want to be in that one. You want to go back to Common just by doing this. Once you get back, this will have all of your games here all, all laid out for you. You then want to rename the file, the aisle file, into the aisle legacy. Just like this and press enter. Right, now, putting it like this, you don't have to have it named the same as mine, but putting the aisle legacy, it's a bit easier because then once uh, later in the steps, all you want to do is erase the legacy part. But for now, this is what we're doing. So once you do that, you go back to the aisle, just like this, and you go to properties, then go to betas, go into here, into this drop down menu and go every month. Once you do this, you'll see it comes up over here, update, and all you want to do is press update. All right, now Avrima has finally downloaded. Um, we're going to go basically do the exact same process. We repeat the same process, go to the files, local files come up here again go common and you'll see that we've still got the legacy one but we've also got the aisle this one so now we're going to do the same process except we're going to copy this we're going to rename this one every um okay so once you've done that then you're going to go basically into the same place properties beta and then go quality assurance this is the test branch so once you do that it is going to start downloading again all right, now, so my quality assurance is finally downloaded um, and this is literally all you have to do now. So you don't ever need to go back into properties. Um, you can just leave it as is now. All you have to do is go into browse local files um, and get the file up. There we go. There it is. Um, go into common and see the aisle. The one that says the aisle will always be the one that plays. So whenever you want to change to a different one, all you have to do is rename this one, say um, test. And then you want, if say you want to play legacy, all we have to do is take away the legacy part and just leave it with the aisle, press enter. And then when we come back to this, all you want to do is get into it. So switching between them becomes so easy. Um, but like I can understand why people get uh, a little bit confused about it. So if you need to just comment down below, we can still, we can try and help you out. Um, uh, probably even get you into the discord so we can actually help you, um, by like sharing screen or something like that. But yeah, so you have to make sure that you do not go into the properties anymore. You do not need to change the betas anymore. Uh, once you've finished it all, you don't need to change it. Um, it will screw things up if you go to change it because obviously you've named all of those differently so none of those the game won't actually recognize that any of them are right until you rename them the aisle yeah so thank you for listening again guys and and um coming to the video like and subscribe for more weekly content and um i hope you guys have a great day